Hello, my name is Tay Che Xiang. Today I'm going to show you the Roland Digital Pianos. I started my piano lesson since quite young. I think I was six years old, maybe. Uh, it was those standard kind of piano lessons like you know, started from. I think I even went to JMC, Junior Music classes or something like that at Yamaha um, and then I, I followed through these like ABRSM syllables and I remember I really hated it I couldn't stand you know, practicing the piano my mom would put a alarm clock on top of the piano and say you had to practice for half an hour maybe she should put the you know the alarm clock there so when she's you know, away doing her stuff I will, I, I will actually turn the clock go faster and faster like so I really hated piano lessons uh, but somehow during my uh, middle school years about 14 years old 15 years years old you know try to try to chase girls like you know <laughs> pick up girls so then there was this one girl in my class that she also learned to play piano so we had kind of like a, a common topic to talk about and then I started to, to practice piano. And then I find, find that I actually kind of you know, started to enjoy music. Um, not, not necessarily the practice, but I, I started to pick up music that you know, kind of spoke to me, kind of touched touch me. And then even better was I started to discover jazz. So that was the time when I was about to prepare uh, to you know, enter colleges. So at that moment, I kind of made the decision. I want to become a musician, and specifically jazz musicians. So then I, I came to KL to attend a college where I, yeah, I started so-called playing jazz from that time. But it took me quite a, a long time, at least a decade, to be able to say that I can play jazz comfortably. So uh, I formed WVC back in the days when I was still studying in the States. Uh, the, the university that I went to is called West Virginia University. So the WV stands for West Virginia Connection because I kind of started it with my classmates. So three of us started playing together. We were doing cover, you know, like, like uh, cover songs jazz standards or even rock standards or even like drum and bass kind of stuff anything that we were you know each of us are checking out so we, we try our best to make it into a jazz rendition and then slowly after I came back to Malaysia um, I kind of keep the band WVC but now it kind of changed changed the, the, the meaning of the of, 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 of this alphabet like, and so now it's become like we very tune or something <laughs> so it got a, a very Malaysian flavor kind of kind of band uh, where I, I have you know throughout the years I have many great Malaysian musicians that I, I have the privilege to play with and over the years we also changed a few uh, personnel but uh, the, the recent one the 2021 version of WBC trio is consists of uh, AJ Pop Shabit and also Adriel Wong a very young and talented drummer so yes i mean jazz actually like the tradition of jazz a lot of the tunes that we play tends to be so-called jazz standards and it's a you know you can call it cover but actually i would say that jazz performance is about improvisation every time you play the same same song it's going to sound kind of different because you 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 do your improvisation every time kind of like when when your creative juice is flowing you try to play different things so even though it's the same song that everybody's playing but everybody have their own versions but at the same time i kind of like i wasn't really happy just you know satisfied with just playing standards playing covers anyhow that's still other people's uh, uh, compositions 
I, I, I would love to, you know, have my own compositions, which I started writing since, since the beginning of the band. So I, I, I was trying my, my hand on. Actually, I would even say that my compos com composition process is a lot of solving musical qu questions, something like that. So, so, so for instance, I, I kind of like have an interest in how, how would you write a melody for these few chords put together? So I will sit down and really work it out. Then it will become a, a new composition. So that's, that's always something for me that I, I really enjoy doing. So that's how a lot of the original composition came about. And also sometimes it's something like, you know, it's a challenge. Let's say, how do you play in 5-4 beats? So I'll write a tune in 5-4 beats. So every time we play, we get to practice, something like that. So over the years, we, we, we have more and more compositions. And sometimes I would like to take a topic, let's say. So one year, it was the 400th 400, 400 anniversary of Shakespeare. So I took on the challenge to write a few pieces based on Shakespeare's works. So that, that's a bunch of compositions that came out that way and things like that. So over the years, we, we accumulated, I think, close to 100 pieces like that. But then at the same time, a lot of music we play also, we try to take unlikely songs and make them jazz. So we will take a lot of like uh, Chinese oldies, songs that really spoke to me when I was young. So like it's, 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 a, it's a part of my culture, part of, part of my background, but we try to make this music jazz. Or recently we really look into Malayan classics, so songs that when I was growing up, I, I really wasn't really aware of them, but slowly by digging through the, the layers of history, then we, we found a lot of really nice tunes and really nice vehicles for improvisation. So we, we will play a lot of like Malayan tunes. So one of the tunes that I just now I played was uh, the Lengang Mak Lima. It's, it's a tune that I always heard during Hari Raya Gan. Like usually <laughs> you, you hear that song. It, it's somehow like, oh wow, it's just such a nice song. So we, 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 we change it to make it uh, kind of like a five beat uh, lenga, you know, shaking. Kind of. So, so it, it's, it's really fun to do that. 